I'm Dutu Echebeneza, CEO of GB House of Beauty. Also a product of ATU under the fashion and design department. Someone who asks how did all this start? As we always say, it begins with a dream. I always loved to do anything artistic, creative arts to be precise. Everything at, 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 at. I loved to be there. A lady in my hood was deeply into this makeup to be precise. So we are like family. So always when she was going to learn, she took me along. When she's about to practice, she calls me over. Then it made me grew more desire for this. I completed JHS and then went to the secondary school, Ofori Penny Senior High School. I was informed too, and then we came for one long vac, and I heard of this makeup class, an intensive class. HB was actually organizing that class. So I called mom and then I spoke to mom. Finance was a little bit difficult, but she called my elder sister, and then they put heads together. And then they supported me financially. But my dad didn't just buy the idea of me being in SHS and then also working at the same time. But mom was like, you don't know tomorrow. What if he does this and then he can support us some way, somehow. And then mom was right, I guess. She gave me all the support I went and then I studied this for a week, just a week and I got back to school. It wasn't a joke. I was practicing with my colleagues back in SHS, Shatter, even my school sons. I was practicing with them. When I came home, my friends who were ever ready to support me and had already supported me from day one were there for me. And then bit by bit, bit by bit, Gilly class came up. I went to study Gilly. Added it. Mom was there again to support financially. I had no money by then. I was a student. So mom supported and then everything went through. I learned Gilly, I learned makeup. When mom was going for any program, I tied Gilly for her. That was where the market started. As an entrepreneur, you should start with family. For sure, if not family, friends who are ready to support you, they would sell you out and then the market starts coming in. So my mom was ever ready to also support me anyhow. And then one way or the other, I completed SHS. I went into the tertiary. Now I'm coming to talk of a male doing makeup. There are a lot of critics. But one thing you should know as a human being is you should know what you are made of and what you are moving towards. When you know these two keys, nothing anyone is going to say would move you. The critics came, they kept coming, but. I knew what I was made of and what I was ready to do, so I just kept pushing. I had knowledge on branding because I was a visual arts student, so I started that and then I was branding myself already, so I was known a bit. I got to a point where I had to get a space to work, but I had no money. Finance from home was not that good. So a woman offered him to help and then I was working with her. I worked with her for some time and then I saw the need to get something for myself. Mom was there. She supported and then I got my studio. I already had students. I was a lucky one as I started, I started getting students. I had five at a go from scratch. And then I moved into my new studio. Those badge graduated. I fixed then one, two strategies and then the market started coming. I loved my clients and then treated them like family so they never betrayed me. Their loyalty were 100%. So they kept coming, kept coming. And then students also kept coming as we were going. So far, so good. It doesn't be smooth. I will lie to you. The critics the tags and the support also that is the good aspect a male doing makeup one thing i have to tell you is if you want to do something you should know what you are made of and you should know what you are moving towards i think if you know these two keys nothing can dismay you you would move towards your goal and then 
you get there. We are not where we seek to be, but thanks to God, we are far, far from where we started. I owe mommy a lot, and I don't know what my life would have been without her. Mommy, God bless you, and I would always be indebted to you. I love you, mom.